In today's video, we're going to look at washed triple salad with the sticker ready to eat, which I've purchased from my local shop in UK. Here we have baby spinach, rocket and watercress from the same bag. I've got a habit of washing salad leaves despite information washed and ready to eat on a packet. I've made this video to show you how clean ready to eat salad really is. To be honest, I was positively surprised that there is pretty much no debris in the bag. However, I found some eggs on spinach leaves. Rocket and watercress were free from eggs, which is good to know. I don't know what insects laid those eggs. Maybe it was snail's job. Your guess is good as mine. I did a bit of research online and eggs on salad leaves is common occurrence. This was actually the first time when I've looked at salad from the back under the microscope and bingo, eggs straight away. I guess during the cleaning process, manufacturer just can't clean those eggs off. Maybe they get there after the wash. I am not familiar with cleaning process of fresh salad in packing factories. And if you do, let us know in the comment section. Here I have an interesting fact from US, that between 1992 and 2000, the period during which the new phenomenon of packed salad took off, nearly 6% of food poisoning outbreaks were associated with prepared vegetables and salads. A study in 1996 of retail samples of packed salad found 13% contained E. coli. Apparently, most salad producers have removed ready-to-eat words from the packets and leave only word washed in present times. My advice would be that you always wash all vegetables and salads before consumption, unless you look at eggs as extra protein, but don't eat too many or you will be pooping snails. With deep green leaves and crisp stems, watercress is related to mustard and is one of the strongest tasting salads leaves available. It has a pungent, slightly bitter flavor and is highly nutritious, containing significant amount of iron, calcium, vitamin A, C and E. I have to say, from watching this clip, watercress looks most appetizing. In the second part of the video, I've squeezed handful of leaves, as I wanted to show you what else is there on their higher magnifications. Good news is that there isn't a lot there. I obviously found some bacteria and few small microbes, which is perfectly normal. Green floating particles are called chloroplasts. They are organelles involved in photosynthesis. I'm sure you've heard of this common term, even if my pronunciation is not that great. Green pigment responsible for color of leaves is called chlorophyll and it's contained inside chloroplast.
here you see a very interesting organism. It moves very gently and it has very smooth look without any distinct features. It looks like tiny bell, but I have absolutely no clue what this is. And lastly, here you have a couple of shots of previously mentioned eggs. I had to squish them as I could not demonstrate them in spherical form. The content of eggs was not really interesting, water mostly, and what's left to see is the outer membrane protecting the egg. I really hope that you've liked this video and please let me know if you would be interested to watch unwashed salads. Many thanks.